showing you how to do just that. Hey, who? I mean, really, what did we do before social media? I mean, right? We sat around our house and watched reruns. I mean, of... it entertains us and it also helps us find a job. Yes. Ryan here with Nerds on Call to help us out. So last time you were here, you helped us set up our business, yes. right? How to do and... your side hustle. Right, right? your side yeah. hustle. Yes. And now you're helping us find that job if you are looking for something. Yeah, and, and these days, you, if you're if you're still typing out an email with a resume attached to it and sending it to an employer and mm, I hope I get right. forget it you're just you're out so instead what I'm going to do is is show you how to target an employer that you want to work for okay. and then go after them okay so first this thing is you need not to do, the way to do it you need to clean up your social profile <laughs> seriously right. we right. found we Look, found Larry, this I told you don't <laughs> post that behind a car drinking a thing and here's okay. here's the thing 92 percent of employers yeah. will look at your social profile yeah absolutely. When you and so if they see this on your social profile, they're going to be like, there's no way this chick's showing up right. on Monday morning. Right. Okay. So forget it. Let's get rid of it. Okay. So clean up your social profile. Make sure you set up a website for yourself. That way you can control the message a little bit. Okay. So you just set up a, a, your own brand. Go to a GoDaddy and buy a domain mm -hmm. for like seven bucks. Mm -hmm. And just say, you know, HulisaOrtiz.com, right. which you don't have one, by the way. We've tried uh, to find one Have you, you found? I thought, have you bought it already? I'll get on that. So anyway, you see, that's, that controls the message. You set up your own website. Okay. You can kind of you know, put some nice pictures up there. Talk about who you are. Um, um, put some little things on there that says, yeah. hey, these are companies I worked for or whatever. Yeah. So that way when, when the employer searches you up, they can say, hey, this person's this is where I want to go. Okay. If you don't know how to build a website, you can just go to WordPress.com. This is a free uh, template you can buy, oh, and okay. you just basically slap the pictures you want on there, write the words you want, and mm -hmm. you're done. It's very, very easy, and that's free. Oh. If that's a little too technical, go to Squarespace, squarespace.com. Okay. Also very easy to use. It's 12 bucks a month okay. for something like that. Then set up your own social profile just for looking for a job. That's oh. that's different from your normal one, okay. right? So the the one where you're drinking with your friends right, or whatever, right, right. you have that one separate. separate. Okay. This one you make public, so that way people can come in and see kind of the things you've done, things okay. you're interested in, and you, again you can kind of curate this a little bit, so that way it doesn't show right. bad stuff, right? Right. Right. So the next thing you want to do is this is we we looked at the best places to work in Sacramento. And we okay. Said, well, where would we want to work? And I thought, you know what a cool place to work at would be hmm. would be a place called Big Hairy Dog. <laughs> Big hair dog. I want to work here, right? What do they do? Well, they're a POS provider. What they okay. do is they, they do technical support oh. for POS systems. So when you buy something at a store. Yeah. But I love the name, Big Hairy Big Dog. Big Hairy Dog. I mean, who wouldn't want to work? I, I work, know. I work at Big Hairy Dog. <laughs> <laughs> so what I did is I looked him up on Facebook and I said, check this out. Oh. This is a company with some personality. Yes. They're on formal Friday. Oh, my God. How cool is that? You come to work in your formal attire. Okay, that's awesome. We need formal Friday. That's awesome. <laughs> Casual Friday. It is so 2016. So here's, here's what you do is just like you would if anybody you want to know on social media, you start following them. You make comments to their blog posts. Don't get freaky. Don't say a bunch yeah. of weird stuff. But if they say something you like, like formal Fridays, you Love say, that. hey, I want to do something like that. And you start to get into their ecosystem. Then what you do is this is another company called Robert Half International here in Sacramento. Uh -huh. If you wanted to go work for them, they're one of the best companies to work for in Sacramento. Mm -hmm. Just go to Twitter and look up. Just do a search for Robert Half International. Mm -hmm. These three dudes work there All and right. check them out. Let's These are pretty out. powerful guys. Managing director, right? International, the, the operations. international operations guy, executive director. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you look them up, just DM them directly on Twitter and say, hey, I'm looking for a job. I see that you do this kind right. of thing and I'm really interested. Telling you. What can I do to help you? Social media, it's a whole different world, yeah. right? And sure can help you out land that new job. Ryan, thank you so much for sticking around next hour. Yes. What are we talking about? International travel. Ooh. How to make it better. So okay. last time we did tips from a travel blogger, but this time we're going to talk about international travel I like and it. how to make it so much easier. It's summertime. Let's get out of town. Let's get out of town. Let's do it. Let's go to Italy. Okay. 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 I'm game. <laughs> All right. Back over to you. All right. Thanks, guys.